some things, what's been going on, keep you updated. I do like to do these every so often so you guys get insight into what's happening in my life. And you can also see maybe why I haven't been uploading, things like that. I genuinely use these far too much as an excuse for why I haven't been doing things I should have been doing. But, uh, you know, you guys are used to that by now, so welcome to the vlog. Now, the first thing I want to talk about actually is something which I'm working on part-time, and it's sort of a new project that I'm starting, and it's sort of, you're sort of going to see it pop up a lot more, and you're sort of going to see it more be sort of like a sponsor to things. Basically, if you don't know, if you haven't followed my Twitter or Facebook or any of the social media that I have, uh, you may not know that I'm actually doing sort of like a computer build slash repair service in the moment on my website, thegaminggeek.co.uk. Basically, if you're looking to get a new computer, if you want to upgrade your current computer, or if you just want a repair done, you can fill out the form. Um, I'll be adding new forms soon for repairs specially, but um, at the moment, you can fill out the same sort of build form and just say that it's for a repair and I'll know. But basically, um, if you're looking to get a new computer, you want a custom build, or you want a repair done, or anything like that, and you just don't want the hassle of doing it yourself, or you don't want to send it off to some company somewhere who may accidentally lose your computer or something, or lose data, or you might come back with a virus or something. All these sort of things are not things I've just made up on the spot here. These are things that I've actually heard happen over years. So if you want to go to someone who you can trust, who you know is going to look after your computer properly, who's going to give it properly, proper one-on-one -on -one attention, who's actually going to do things you know, thoroughly and professionally, and going to give you a really unique service, then I just advise that you do fill out the form and I'll send you over a quote. Uh, you can fill out that on the form, you can put your current budget, uh, what operating system you want, uh, it could be Mac or Windows, uh, basically you can also say what sort of computer you want it to be, if you want it to be like a workstation computer or a gaming computer or just even like an office computer, it can be for any need at all, you can have whatever you want, whatever specification and I'll try and, try and make that happen. So I come back to you uh, within a couple of days with a quote and if you like that you have seven days to actually sort of say that you want to take that computer at that current price. Um, after that, I sort of have to re-quote the price and things like that as prices change so frequently. But uh, if you come back within seven days, then um, I can, you know, sort of um, promise you that you'll get it at that price. After that, it's sort of a little bit um, unsure, depending on how prices have changed. So basically, yeah, if you want a, a build service, you want a repair service, upgrade service, and you want it to be done professionally, and you want it to be done, you know, with a bit of thought and care, and, you know, every computer build, for new build, comes the one... Uh, year return to base warranty. So if you can return it to me within a year, you will get uh, whatever problem it is wrong with the computer, you get the part changed or um, technical support or anything like that. I can provide that for one year only. After that, it sort of gets a bit difficult. So if it's slight sort of like technical support uh, to do with more software based things, I'll be able to help you out over email. But after that, uh, in terms of hardware, sort of warranties and stuff start to get a bit more um, rough in terms of what's left on what so really one year is what I'm sort of giving on that and yeah um, I am also running deals at the moment so if you are interested at the moment um, fill out the form and I'm doing deals where I can give you Windows 7 for free as a special offer I can give you Microsoft Office 2010 for free as a special offer and maybe even as an antivirus software as well thrown in as well so if you go if you're really keen at the moment to get a new PC definitely fill out a quote as you may be able to get a really good deal that's what I'm going to talk about it. I'm not going to go into much detail about it again, but you may see it pop up. If you see it around the place, then that might be because of it. I'm trying to ramp up sort of the advertising. So if you know a friend, you know someone who's sort of interested in upgrading a computer or things like that, I'd really appreciate it if you could send it over to them. That'd be a really, really good link description for more details. And yeah, you may see it pop up. Now you know. Okay, so the second piece of news I want to talk about is not me trying to sell you anything or trying to do anything like that. It is basically um, a short film that I have completed. Now, unlike the other things where it was sort of like, oh, they give us footage or da 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 da, this short film was actually something that was worked on from the ground up. It's about eight minutes long and it was for a project, but we took it really professionally and it was professionally shot and edited. And um, basically, if you want to know how much impact I had on the film, it's uh, it's technically my film in a lot of aspects. We did, um, we did do a big brainstorm and other people's ideas were thrown in, but I wrote the script. Uh, I directed it and I is and I did the final edit. Uh, but I do want to say a big thanks to all the guys on my team who helped out. Obviously, it's for the course anyway, but um, you know everyone sort of chipped in and really worked hard. So um, if any of you guys are watching it, then I really do appreciate um, like everyone making an effort, and we think we work well as a team. So there we are, big props, and I will put um, in in the actual description of the actual video that uh, that for the short film. 
all the cast and crew members and actors and um, the actors in there worked really really hard and things like that and thank you to um, the actual bed store that we used we filmed in a bed store at one point it was a uh, Warren's bed store uh, so if you live down in Southampton go and check them out there'll be a link description to uh, contact details for them as well because they worked really really hard so yes uh, basically you know, this is a short film, it's the first one we've created as a team, it's the first one I've ever written, it's the first script I've written, um, and the first short film I've really di directed, or in fact edited, so it's a lot of firsts in this one, but I think it's, I think it's come out just how I sort of intended it to, I think it looks really good, and I'd appreciate if you guys can go check out the short film and let me know what you think, there'll be a link in the description to the short film, you can go and watch it, um, it's on the Geek Web Media channel at the moment, which is basically sort of my, um, hub for things like this so if you do want to subscribe to that channel go over there and you'll be able to see more of this sort of thing so if you're interested in that sort of thing definitely go over and check that out uh, but yeah so hopefully you guys enjoyed the short film give me some feedback on it i really appreciate that and uh, yeah that's it for sort of part two of the vlog okay so the final part i just really want to talk about what i'm doing sort of today what i'm doing next how my youtube's working and also just sort of more of a personal sort of uh like how things are going Basically, I've been really, really busy at the moment. Like uni, like with the short film and things like that, and with other hand-ins, I've had lots of things going on, so it's really been very difficult for me to sort of keep control of what's going on on YouTube and sort of keep everything running at the same time. I've also been doing a lot of help uh, for, uh, for VicCraft and for, um, which is VicStar's server. So I've been actually, because I, I was sort of inactive on there in a while, mainly because I had problems getting on the server and things like that when I was at uni. Managed to find a way around that and uh, basically, I'm helping out a lot more there as well because I feel like I owe it to them. So uh, if you do, if you're interested, by the way, I'm playing a Minecraft server. You know, if you if you want a, a new sort of server to check out, and you want to play some survival games. The minute we've got faction survival games, we are adding mini games very very soon. Uh, but please go out and check uh, Vic, Vic Star's server. It's really cool. Really nice bunch of staff there. You know, we we all work as really hard behind the scenes to try and uh, make the server as best we can. So that's coming from someone who actually knows what goes on behind the scenes. Honestly, the guys there work really hard. Uh, to try and give you guys the best server we possibly can. So there we are. If you want to support that, then go over and check that. Uh, I feel like I've plugged too many things today, but oh well, we'll continue on. Anyway, I've been busy with those things, been busy with the uni, been busy with lots of different things going on. So basically my channel, uh, yet again, has been about burner, which it has been a few times. So I hope you guys can sort of appreciate uh, why. Um, I've not let it affect The Sims, so I know there's a lot of people, I know that's sort of the main core of my channel, the main core of the audience, so I've sort of made sure that Sims has always been a priority, and Sims episodes have been going out as usual, I've even been doing the live streams, so hopefully you guys are enjoying that. Um, but yeah, I'm hoping to crank up the live streams now, I'm up uni till like the end of May, uh, mainly because I'm paying to be here until the end of June anyway, so I thought I might as well spend a bit longer here. Um, that's the current plan is in the May, I don't know how things will turn out, but that's my current plan. And yeah, lots of things have been going on towards that. And yeah, hopefully now, because things are starting to, start to slow down and I'm starting to get more of a hold of things. I've only got one more hand in left and I've got plenty of time for that, so hopefully I can sort of start making more videos, doing the live streams and things like that, so yes! Thumbs up if that sounds like a good thing, and it should be happening this time. So yeah, I'm having a really big think of what series I want to start, what I want to continue with, how I'm going to move things forward. So yes, just keep an eye out for things. Um, there'll be another video out today, by the way, this is not just the only video I'm doing. There will be another video out today to sort of uh, pay it back to you guys, so stay tuned for that as well. Keep your eyes peeled, because I know the subscription boxes have been a bit sort of weird at the moment. So, so yeah, I think that's basically all I have to say, though. I think that's everything. I probably will have missed something, and then afterwards I will be like, oh no, why didn't I say such and such? But for now, thank you guys for watching the video. Thank you guys for enjoying the vlog. If you made it this far, then you are totally awesome. And yet again, stuff. Thank you guys. As always, drink tea and game on. So, welcome to the outro, which I've started doing since about now, apparently. Um, I did forget to say one thing, so uh, if you do enjoy podcasts and do enjoy gaming podcasts and things like that, um, it's not quite a podcast, but it's very, very similar. If uh, you do like that sort of thing, then tune in to The Geek Show, which is on Radio Sonar, uh, 4 till 6 every Thursday. Uh, I'll put a link in the description to the actual radio page. And if you tune in, I'll be on there, my co-host Martin will be on there, and sometimes a special guest. I will be talking through the latest gaming news, tech news, film news, play some awesome music, play some awesome games, as in sort of radio games, not video games, because you wouldn't be able to see... Uh, yeah, so tune in, and if you do enjoy it, then that'd be great. Get involved with the show, and it's sort of like a podcast, but it's not quite. So 4 till 6, British time, radio sonar, tune in, be there or be square. And here's another video that I made at some point to go and check out if you haven't seen it already.
that's it. And that's all I got. But I thought you'd have gone by now, to be honest with you. But, uh, no, you're still here. Still just waiting. Well, I think I'll just leave now because you're clearly, clearly taking the pee. Really, just, just go, just go now, just please, bye.